All right, we want to find the derivative here. So what we'll do, we'll do use substitution here. So u will be equal to, um, you know what? That's not going to work. Well, all we have to do here, this is the chain rule. So here's our coefficient here. So 4 over 3 pi and then d dx of sine of 3t. And then we take the derivative of what's on the inside. So, um, oh, I don't know how you'd say that. So, uh, but the derivative of what's on the inside will be 3t plus 4 over 5 pi times d dx or d dt. I'm sorry, I need to get these right. Of the cosine of 5t and then d dt of 5t. So then what we end up with here is 4 over 3 pi times, and I put, take the 3 here, so that's 3. And then the derivative of the sine is the cosine of 3t. Plus, derivative of the cosine is negative, negative, and then we get 5, and then sine of 5t. So this 5 cancels this out, this 3's over here cancel out, so we end up with 4 over pi cosine 3t minus, because this, 5 over, not 5, excuse me, uh, 4 over pi, um, because these two fives cancel out, sine of 5t. And if you want, you can factor out the 4 pi, but we can just leave it. And that's it. And this is what um, s prime is equal to. All right. I hope that helped you out. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.